loved it, man. That's definitely like one of the best clubs I've ever played. I'd say, just from the way the dedication of like how the staff is there with sound and the the lighting technician is insane. Like this guy is crazy. Man, you had to get there early just to get in because it was just full of like you know really cool people and probably the hottest music out there. So and it was like the only place I wanted to go out at the end of the night if I wanted to go to a kind of a, a proper club night with a, with good music. To me, Real Grooves is about authentic experience. People come together and they're able to interact and very easily, you know, end up with a smile on their face. Great to be in there all night with people sweating away and yelling to what you were doing and having a great time. It was amazing and I played, I think so, six or eight hours. And it was definitely in my top five clubs for sure. And it's nice too, it's a balance too of getting that dance floor where it's packed, like small enough that people are kind of shoulder to shoulder. It's very rare to find a club like that for sure. Once a month, it was just what I live for. I had way, um, too much fun every time, I'd say. I was left a little wounded from, from those nights. I think Yellow was probably probably the best club I had ever played at in the world. Certainly wouldn't think that one of the most famous clubs in the world was right here, you know? I don't know. Look at it. I mean it just doesn't it doesn't look like a club. It's not a tip that's one thing that's great about Japan. You know? Clubs don't look like clubs usually. Kind of hidden spaces.